For the month of April then, I'm actually doing a 10,000 V-Bucks giveaway for celebrating 100,000 subscribers. If you wish to enter that, the link is in the description below. What's up guys and welcome back to another Fortnite Battle Royale video. We have a quick one right here on all the locations for all the known vending machines around the map. And we also just have some little bit of gameplay of how the vending machine work, etc. So before the video starts, leave a like, that would be greatly appreciated. And now let's finally jump into today's video. So with today's update, we actually have the all new vending machines where you can deposit materials to actually get something back from the vending machines. And I actually have gameplay of this happening as well and also all the locations. So without further ado, let's finally jump into today's video then. So big shout out to Fortnite Intel for this um, i'm pretty sure these videos are from reddit and or twitter but um here is the uh picture we have on screen right now which shows all the location all the vending machines anarchy acres pleasant park loot lake tilted towers greasy grove shifty shafts you know retail row lonely lodge when and woods tomato tell there's a lot of these and these are actually accurate because i've been playing and i've actually been dropping at these known locations and i've actually been getting some of these uh vending machines to actually pop up for me as well and i noticed when i was in retail row and even on the map it shows that there's two locations and yes there actually was two vending machines at retail row so this is quite an accurate map so if you want to go off of this then feel free to do that and also here I have some gameplay of it actually working as you can see I um, I farmed for like I think it was about 500 wood and I actually deposited the 500 wood I think I don't think it was 500 wood I think it was 400 wood I actually had to deposit but I thought it was 500 anyway so I had enough anyway so yeah I deposit it and I actually got myself a heavy shotgun back. Now, I know the rates of this are quite, uh, I think it's 100 for an uncommon, 200 for a green, 300 for a blue, 400 for a purple, and 500 for a yellow. Now, my whole opinion on this side of things, I'm not too sure these are actually going to be, um, you know, received well by the community because, you know, 500 wood and you can get yourself a gold scar. That is quite crazy, if I do say so myself. I think it has to be a bit more strict, and maybe it'll be a bit better. I know me, personally, I actually prefer having my materials rather than actually just depositing them. Of course, I did it for the gameplay, but I'd rather have my materials to build, because, of course, that is the biggest outplay mechanic in this game, is the building. So, you know, the way it's going to be received, I don't know. So, I hope you have enjoyed all the locations and a little bit of gameplay, how it works. If you have, leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. Comment down below any other videos you guys would like to see. And also, I just want to say um you know is this going to be good you know let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section below about this because i want to see what you guys think about this do you think it's a bit too easy to get stuff or do you think it's actually quite a fair trade let me know in the comment section below and i will see you guys on the next video